Hey guys, today I'm going to be installing the strong arm upgrade spring from Orange Mavericks into the strong arm. And um, this is going to be a pretty basic mod guide, just consisting of a spring placement and then taking out the dart pegs. Because Orange Mavericks actually re recommends you not to take out the restrictor for this thing. So we're going to take out all the screws first, which are on this side of the body. And there's three on the slide rail. First take off the ones on the slide rail, then the slide rail will pop off. And then after you're done, after you've done that, just take off all the ones. I have on the taken out all the screws on the strong arm, and including the ones on the slide rail. And the slide rail should just pop off like this. And there's little some like little grooves in here to indicate where it should be, so you don't have to worry about that. And try to keep the other side on because it's like it makes things a lot more a lot easier when you're putting it back together. And now since I've taken them all off, I will now gently pry it apart, or at least try to. And then, you can see it's already coming apart. Whoa. To get this side off of the strong arm using a flat, flat head screwdriver, um, and it just pops off. And as you can see, there are very, very complicated internals in here. Actually, I, I'm not very sure how this even works. But I'm pretty sure it's a direct plunger. Which means instead of like the plunger hey guys, going back or back of this thing, and um, uh, so after the barrel comes out pretty easily, you can see there are dart pegs back here. I've already taken out five of them. They look like this, and I'll take one off in on camera. So all you have to do is take your pliers, hang on to this from the back, and just twist, and it just like literally pops off like that. So it's a pretty simple process. And I'll investigate a little bit more about this plunger because the only other mod we'll be doing is replacing the spring. And then take that, out the plunger um, head, which you do by simply lifting this up and pulling it out. And it has the spring on it, which we'll be replacing like right now with the orange mod work, seven kilogram strong arm uh, spring. So I'll take this out real quick. And then it seems like there's no real way right now to get the spring out, so I didn't like improvise, maybe. Maybe like twist it off or something. Oh, there you go. It's pretty simple. Never mind. Here it is. And I'm just gonna put. Yeah, there's some right on there. Let's take this one. Yeah, anyways, once I get the spring on here, um, I'm pretty sure you just off them. Got it. So I'm just gonna twist this spring on real quick. And since I'm at it, I'm just gonna um, Teflon tape the o ring and grease it as well. So, and there's a little bit of space right here, so I might fill that up with hot glue, I'm still deciding. And after that, I, I'm finish all our mods, all mods to the Nerf strong arm with the spring replacement, dart post removal, and seal improval. And now I think we can put it back together. So I'm gonna try to set this thing in, so it could be a little bit difficult. And actually, we can do, there's one more thing we can do, and that is a full barrel drop. Um, I think there are two pegs, one over here, one over here. All we have to do is, for example, you can use a Dremel or some some device to cut it off. Um, I, I'm deciding whether to do that or not because it already drops out a lot, but then um, it could be useful. So um, I'll tell you after I put it back together whether... I, I just finished the strong arm mod and it turned out very well. I actually just went outside to range test it um, and it shoots just... Um, at its maximum and about a hundred angle. So as a demonstration, I'm just gonna shoot a few darts off just so you can hear the velocity and just how far it is. The stepping doesn't actually work very well, but just for like viewing purposes, I'm gonna show it anyways. So um, I'm going to fire off three normal darts and three slam fire. So as you can see, here's a normal dart. Um, I'm around 30 feet away from the door, and you can just hear how fast it gets there. This thing is really, really loud. And that was the second. And I'm just going to fire three off slam fire. Obviously has a much harder prime, and um, I also upgraded the catch spring with a different spring, like a, just, and it happened to fit perfectly. And that was not because I intended to, but because I actually lost the other one. And um, but I don't think it's really necessary. Like if you don't have that, then I don't think you have to put it in. Um, but this was a very successful mod, 
And uh, one thing that I didn't do was do a full barrel drop, but I actually decided that I'm not going to do that. Or I might in the future, like open it up again and then maybe do that with a Dremel. But since I don't have access to a Dremel at the moment, I'm not going to do that. And um, the, uh, this is a pretty nice mod, and if, you, if you're going to do this, then definitely. And um, so thanks for watching.